Magnus RP, but Enigma, you get like two black holes in a really late game if Enigma keeps up on the farm, and like, yeah. I think even late game fights is kind of 50-50. I mean, they've got a jungle enigma, so if it's a trading farm more, they're going to be coming out on top there. Yeah, looking at uh, the initial farm, it's kind of all over the place, but uh, still 0-0, zero, zero, Malaysia. There's seven heroes with ten or more CS, so... Yeah. There's a lot of heroes oh. who are actually getting farm in lane. Mid lane, Lich will go down, first blood drawn by Mushi. Miracle looking for a recovery kill, not going to find it. Lovey on his way in, but now Net connects with a stun. They might be able to make it too. Wisp Balls will bring him down. Now Lovey goes on to Net, finds the kill there as Lich hits him with a Frost Blast, but it's a one for two. And MY coming out way ahead off this mid lane scuffle. Both with the combo. That yeah, I, I think Lovey thought he could come contest the room with the black hole, but Radiant's because the combo hit both of them, that's some nasty damage. Foundation. Yeah, even Paulus in on the run from the top lane. A couple Dyer's of these Eidolons get cleaned attack. up. You gotta watch your blueberries there, Enigma. Life. Now Mushi looking for a kill on Lich, finds it with a toss, and KYXY uses his body to get that one. Now Lovey coming in with a black hole, perhaps. Avalanche will get the kill on the Enigma. Now Miracle, he'll get hexed up. He's in some trouble. Jakiro comes in. Macro Pyre flies through, but they've already gotten the kill on Naga. The double on Mushi. And maybe even a triple. Hana's in a lot of trouble here. First departure, they're crumbling. Now they get the kill on Jakiro. It's a triple kill for Mushi. Paulson comes in. He gets comboed up. Gets the stun onto Mushi Mushi's now. This kill. <laughs> oh my god, this tiny. He'll lose his wisp, but he'll be crying. The biggest number, but at this stage of the game, it's insane. Normally, you see that Very like impressive. seven, eight hundred GPM only, like later on when you get tower gold and really start snowballing. But this already for Mushi is wow, he's yeah. really good bottom. Yeah, right on to Hana. Ohio starts it off, but there's your combo from Tiny. Give him one more punch. Stone doesn't taste so good for breakfast. Shane Frost, they might end his streak. Unstoppable kill. Goes the way of Lich. Nice 512 gold on that one. Yeah, it's a nice nice chunk of change for the Lich, but it's a Lich. It's the least useful hero to get it on. You would run on anyone except the Lich, unfortunately, but... Yeah. Miracle finding himself in some trouble. Ohio comes in. Reverse polarity's online. He's not even going to need it. Miracle's just going to get destroyed by the Lion and the Wisp doing a lot of damage. So Medusa doesn't even need to go for the hard carry items and the space being created for the rest of the team and Malaysia will just keep first departure mid while Medusa can just keep on farming. Yep, Net, uh, Net is on the high ground here looking for the initiation. Cliff comes out, tower goes down, now he comes in, shows himself, goes in on the Hana, has the finger, drops the Jakiro. Murak on the high ground, will start throwing some auto some attacks. Maybe. And not hole. Go for it. He had no. song. He could have used that to maybe set up the black hole. Oh, the RP on the lobby. He might be able to get uh -oh. off a black hole here. There's the song. Can he find four heroes with this? Black hole on four. No but problem. the damage is it's yeah. not there. <laughs> <laughs> what what damage? Paulson oh, gets hexed. Oh, good kill on the Magnus. Barely. But this Solution's is probably dead here. Oh, nice Delta. They won't be able to connect with the hoof stomp, and now he gets tossed. Mushi punching him. A few more auto attacks. Centaur just a little bit too tanky. Looks like he'll live. Net. Yeah, just barely. Gets left behind. Hit by a dual breath, but Mushi, he's got a little Mushi's bit of mana. never done. He's got company. I mean, I feel this is a 4v5. Dusa is just farming. Man, I feel like it's a 3v5. What's Magnus done? Yeah. <laughs> he, was, he was at least there, like we could say. But. Hey, he RP'd once, you know? That's yep. something. Now, you make a good point, though. This is just Team Malaysia running all in. This is sort of what we expected the first game to be like, almost. Malaysia are the heavy favorites here, and they're really showing they're going to find Miracle now. Yep, getting an easy pick off here. They soften him up. Mushi comes in with the combo, and Tiny gets yet another kill. Miracle just completely shut down. 12 and a half minutes. <laughs> oh god, now Paulson down bottom. I don't know what the stats are on that one, but this could be the fastest axe in like competitive Dota. Going for an ab or uh, a defusal it looks like. Dyer's so get a tier one tower, tower down bottom. Oh, no, probably Dyer's a Yasha. Yasha. Why would I say defusal? Dyer's all the Dyer's items. Probably a Yasha. Yeah. Yasha, maybe a Mensa, but even just the casual Yasha is. Yeah. yeah just fine. Look at Ohio up here, he's just Dyer's hanging out, getting some vision, no ready to hop down. <laughs> Hit him with the RP. It's still on cooldown, but he's just getting ready. He's, yeah, he's got to put the ward up there, but I think he blinked up there to maybe plan it. It's actually a good spot to hide, actually. Like, Naga Siren almost has to be here at this bottom lane because the Song of the Siren is actually important to set up some of these other spells like Ice Path, Macropire, Black Hole. Dyer's There's a great teamfight combo combo for first departure, but it means Naga Siren spends less time farming as a result. Here's Net going in on the Hana, drops the finger, sets up the combo for Mushi. Easy kill on the Jakiro to get it started. 
Now Miracle coming around the side, has the song that you talked about, but Mushi's just tanking the tower, Fire cleaving it down. Did they go for this? Paulson comes in, they do a lot of damage to Mushi. And, okay, Mushi. Yeah, they get a kill on Tiny, but they lose they the tier 2 tower. Now. now the net. Or, pardon me, the song right on the net, and Chaos, they cancel the song, there you go. They'll finally get some cleanup kills, but no, the relocate out. Wisp will play Sacrificial Lamp, saves his friend, Net gets taken down. We could only save one, though. Center actually went for the Blink Sun on Wisp, I think. He blinked, he blinked forward looking for that Wisp, but couldn't find him. He brings Chaos back with him, Stone Gaze online. So he'll actually try and turn this around. Stampede used by Paulson, he'll blink away. Mm -hmm. Oh, Enigma, where are you? Mid lane gets initiated on, relocate in. Mushi chasing him under the tower. His friends are nearby. Neck gets caught in the Yules from the Chikiro. He'll get set up here. Now the two fights breaking out, but they get the first kill on the Wisp. Now the lion goes down. Uh oh. Wow, that was expensive. But the four staff, he can't find the skewer. Now they set it up onto Mushi. Paulson going in. Mushi taking a lot of damage here. The stampede's been used. Merkel puts them all to sleep with the Song of the Siren. Black Hole on two. No relocate out. They'll bring down Mushi. Now they'll find KYXY. They know which targets are the valuable ones. And they'll find the kill on the Tiny. Now they get the Wisp. KS just suffered the top lane farming push, which I think is fine. That's his job there. But Malaysia should not be taking fights into the Song Black Hole. Like that. It's just not going to work. The RP, I guess he was looking for the Naga where the Black Hole's on cooldown. So they actually want to play very conservatively. Farm the Naga. Even the Enigma, like, farm up a BKB. And I think the Refresher is the next item after the BKB. Like, screw Blink. This game, the Black Hole cooldown is what's going to screw over first departure. So I think getting Refresher ASAP is a big. Mm -hmm. Paulson goes in on KYXY. Hits him with a stun. And now the combo comes out from Tiny. They blow up the Wisp. Tiny caught inside of a Yules. Now Mushi's left all alone. And in comes Ohio. RP on two, pushes him over the macro pyre. There's your black hole coming out. Net will interrupt it, but still sets up for the kill. They bring down the Naga, lose the Centaur. Net helping to make these plays happen. Now the Medusa coming in to try and clean house. It's a three for three. Ice Path does not connect, and Lovey nowhere for him to go. He buys his Mithril Hammer. Mostly reliable gold. Gets a little bit of extra before he goes down. Yeah, I like that. That was play. cute. He gets a little extra, but he also feeds. Still gonna do what he can in terms of damage up top. Just pulling Mushi off the tower. Midnight Pulse taking down Mushi fast, but bottom lane, we gotta check it out. Net comes in, does a lot of damage to the Jakiro, and now this tier 3 tower is gonna be up for grabs. Meanwhile, on the top lane, they kill the Wisp. They kill the Tiny. They got what they came for, but their base. Good for this fight. Stone Gaze is used. Miracle still just running right next to him. They're still looking at this. Stampede's used. Paulson chasing the Wisp, who is hasted up in the jungle. Ohio he'll dive to tier one tower. Yep, Ohio even uses an RP for this, but he'll get locked down. Now Net comes in. Can they die? Yep, yeah, they'll bring down the Naga Siren on Miracle to relocate in. Aluka taking a lot of damage. Hana does connect with an ice path, maybe buy some time, but now Lovey, he'll get picked off and. Things just falling apart for first yeah. departure. Miracle held his song a long, long time there, and when the relocate came in, just had to score against this uh, this Medusa. I mean, they just don't have anything to I kill Chaos with. I think so the like main argument against it is that he's at no point have we even seen him fighting into Chaos, and I think even getting a defusal wouldn't change that. He can't m really man fight. Yeah, I don't know that a Lincoln's is going to change that either. Though. They'll go straight in. Ohio gets caught out, but Chaos doing a lot of damage. Uses the Stone Gaze. Lich goes down. They do find the kill on Magnus. Now Nat isolated in the corner. Paulson will lock him down. Finds the kill there. Dusa almost gets Jakiro, but he'll TP out. Now Dusa's left all alone. It's a two for one. Lich will buy back. They cut through the mana pool, and now Medusa gets locked down. Mur We'll just go blow for blow, and all right, that's the Aegis of the Immortal. Medusa coming back up. Could be a potential relocate. Wisp is used, and he's re relocated in. Tiny's joined the party. Black hole on two. It'll catch the cores, and now the Lich Alt flying through, bouncing around all the heroes, doing a lot of damage. Chaos and Mushi, they may fall. Mushi goes down first. Not enough time for the relocate. Wombo combo. Oh, FD, they're right back in it. BKB, do they actually have the damage to bring him down? Ice Path, they can do a hell of a lot. Now Net Ohio comes in. There's your Chain Frost bouncing around Lovely. heroes. He, he blinked into a disable and couldn't get the RP off. Mushi's trying to fight his way out of this one, but it's not going to work. Oh no, that's a two for nil on course. Top lane, relocate up. These are two really big items. There's your Refresher Enigma. Will he use it? Song. There's the Refresher. A big black hole incoming, boys. Mushi and KYXY. They'll get lubed up. They'll get chain frosted. But it's Ohio with the plays. 
He interrupts the black hole. Chain Frost still bouncing around Mushi, taking a lot of damage in the front lines. Magnus goes down first. Mushi will not be able to live. He will fall. It could be a dieback on the Dusa. She's out of mana. She's stuck inside of the ice path. And they'll focus all ammunition onto her. KYXY tethered up. They get the kill on Lion. Everybody on the side of Malaysia getting cleaned up. KYXY gets stuck off to the side. Looks like they'll be separated. No tether buddy for you, KS. He'll get chased down slowly but surely. He gets chopped down. GG. What? That last RP from the higher, like, it cancelled the hole, but he already had two seconds. Like, he had enough duration on that black hole that it was perfectly fine for first departure. Ooh. That was just... Phenomenal play. I mean, Mericon is Naga Siren, definitely the talk of the town, but even the rest of the first departure team played amazing to actually stall this game out. Like, they held onto that bottom rack for so long, thanks to the Centaur place, thanks wow. to the Jakiro Hannah to me. If, I mean, I don't even know if I'd call Miracle the MVP. Hannah had so many clutch Yules, Ice Path. He found up a